yet it is safe for you to love, open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all, heart-to-heart -heart conversations, honestly discuss your feelings with each other, trust the situation calling is calling you for you to have faith. So, you know, be having the trust, you know, be feeling safe around this person, um, giving one another assurance that they're going to be there for one another, that they're gonna not going to drop the ball, okay? So that's what I'm feeling with this three, these three cards. And then we have Lilies. Lilies talks about contentment, happiness, and talking about support, you know, um, ongoing support could be ancestors, could be your family, or a person, a gentleman, is giving you support, like a maternal supporter, some kind of a motherly instinct and authority here with this bear. Um, and this bear signifies that these two girls will finally find their prince charming. So I feel like, you know, there is like a maternal instinct or like a, a protector that I see. There's this, um, there's a transformation as well. There's some changes going on um, in your person's life or your life that is making you feel content. There's a strong parental energy here um, around you or it could be you. But there's a feeling of like safety net or like a like a s being safe a feeling of you know there's i'm safe here there's nothing to worry that i'm feeling here so it's just for my libra and let's do your celtic cross just a moment um i'm also sensing like you are protected libra you are protected there's definitely protection here so um current energy we have wow the nine of pentacle and the nine of cups our wish fulfillment card at the very top you have the seven of wands, all right? Um, underneath is the moon, what the universe want you to know. In the past is the page of swords, what it wants to point out in the past, and the two of pentacles. Um, all right, so let's see. All right, so there is the nine of cups here, and nine of cups um, by its flesh means a wish fulfillment. Um, wish granted, you know? It's like feasting as well, or like a drinking spree, like a celebration, and you're being commended, you're being celebrated, um, just free, victory, success, you have the advantage, all right? And then we have this king of wands, I feel like you're being celebrated for being this king of wands, and um, this is a fire energy, um, Aris, Leo, Sage, and uh, this is someone who... This is power, so you're gaining a power, and very passionate, uh, very good with words. There may be some communication that's going to come he in here with this victory and success. There may be some kind of like um, someone that's going to tell you about this victory, or you may have received some news about you know this very good news, Libra. Um, but there is just happiness here that I see. Let's get more information. At the very top is the seven of Wands and seven of wands. It talks about standing in your power, standing your ground, and not minding what other opinions are um, about a contract, about a partnership, about a person that you are committed to. It could be that this feminine energy here is really standing their ground in their commitment towards you, and whatever idea comes to mind against you they always trample down or they always make a way to make it work and so it will go for the relationship for the benefit of the relationship here uh, what's underneath what the universe wants you to know is the moon and the page of wands the moon talks about hidden enemies darkness deception error um, basically the path is not clear there's some kind of a, um, a loomy business going on here but there's the page of wands um, in this page of wands, right or the b bad is my, you know, knowing what you want and having the zest or this vitality or the vigor to proceed and go for it. Like you're starting a new journey here. It could also be new beginnings. Um, page one um, of the story. And yeah, he is, he is in the act of proclaiming. He wants, there's someone wanting to say about what he is proclaiming. So this, the moon card talks about a Piscean energy or a Cancerian energy um, that maybe wants to proclaim proclaim something to you. And 
it's somehow what they really want, what they are initiating something that they want to proceed long term with. So, yeah, that could be like Piscean, or yep, that's what I'm getting here. Because this is the sign and this is the action, right? So, that can be. In the past, we have the Page of Swords and the Sun. So the Page of Swords is an Earth sign or an Air sign. This is like our spying card. This is also like a new beginning. Like you could be studying again, or you could be investigating something, or you could find like a like a insp inspiration to study again, or go to the books. But um, uh, authority overseeing, secret service, vigilance. Yeah, Secret Service, the Sun. So I feel like if this is you in the past, there was some kind of a clarity over what you were um, trying to understand or trying to investigate on. So something in the past that you found out that um, a new beginning that's, that gave you, that gives rise to success or material success. So something that you have put much effort in that granted you some kind of a monetary um, you know monetary blessings here contentment and so let's proceed and then we have the two of Pentacles and the six of Pentacles so the two of Pentacles this is after you've received the ace of Pentacles it talks about material and financial blessings now you're integrating that material and financial blessings into your day-to-day -day life you may be juggling two or three things at once and I feel like I mean and, and I feel like you know as you go along with the two of Pentacles it may get harder because you know you're juggling two things at once and one of them may have to give in here that is one of the meaning that um, that's the only negative um, on this uh, two of Pentacles um, but with this, something is giving in here with the things that you're juggling. And I feel like whatever it is giving in, you are maybe have to cover it or recover it. Oops. Yeah, okay, so sorry about that. So you may have to, you know, something is giving in. Um... Yeah, this, this this person you may have to choose here, and y and there is a you you may be at a point where you know you will have to choose you have to make a decision, and I feel like you're gonna make a decision here, which is gonna going to give you more allowance, more time for yourself, and and more liberty, right? Um, giving you more free time I feel here Libra so this is actually up to you um, this is just you know trying to map out what it is that could be going on with your head or with how you're you um, think those thoughts and just putting them on the table it's for you to better to control what you can control and let go of the things that we, we cannot so I'm gonna have to stop it right there and I'll talk to you guys next time take care God bless bye bye